women have frequently endured severe and horrific penalties throughout history for a variety of causes. Can you imagine being punished for having an opinion, for being self-reliant, or even for being a woman? That regrettably was the situation for many women throughout history. We'll be looking at some of the most horrifying and terrible forms of punishment that women have endured throughout history. So let's get started. Number five in the list is burning at the stake. During the Middle Ages and the early modern era, burning at the stake was a particularly harsh punishment that was applied all across the world, but especially in Europe. This penalty was occasionally meted out to women who were charged with a variety of offenses such as witchcraft or treason. The suspect was bound to a wooden stake that was frequently positioned so that the crowd could view him or her. Then, kindling and other combustible items like straw or wood were placed around the individual, and the fire was kindled. The victim would be consumed by the flames, which would burn their skin, flesh, and bones, and cause them much pain and suffering. Can you imagine the amount of cruelty women went through back then for speaking out or raising their voices? Would you accept such brutality if you were born in that era, or would you rebel against such cruelty? Moving on to our next practice, have you ever seen someone being stoned at? No? Then let us tell you. Number four in the list is stoning. The condemned individual is pelted with stones until they die in a process known as stoning. This type of punishment has been employed historically throughout cultures and religions, and in some nations it is still an acceptable method of execution. The condemned person is frequently carried to a public plaza or other designated location where a crowd gathers to watch the execution, which usually involves stoning. Today, stoning is considered as an inhumane exercise and regarded as a violation of human rights. But do you think it's the right way to punish someone? Well, definitely not. Let's move on to our next practice, which is the Iron Maiden. An instrument of torture known as the Iron Maiden is thought to have been employed in Europe throughout the Middle Ages. It is a towering iron structure in the form of a coffin that is covered in spikes. The victim would be placed within the Iron Maiden, the door would be shut, and the victim would be pierced by the spikes, resulting in excruciating suffering and frequent death. Today, it has become illegal to use this technique, but can you imagine how painful it would have been for women who went through such brutal times? Did you know that in earlier times, flogging or beating was a common punishment for women accused of various crimes? It involved being whipped with a leather strap or rod until the skin was broken and bleeding. Moving further, you surely must have heard of a duck, but have you ever heard of a ducking stool used for punishment? The ducking stool was a form of torture that was applied to women in Europe during the medieval and early modern eras, who were charged with different offenses, especially those involving gossip or other types of social deviance. The contraption was essentially a chair that could be swung back and forth like a pendulum by a long wooden arm or pole. The chair would be lowered into a body of water, such as a pond or river, while the accused woman was tied to it. The woman would be held under water for an extended amount of time, frequently for several minutes at a time, while the chair was submerged in the water. With this, you can understand how terrible and gloomy the lives of opinionated women in the past were. They had no right to raise questions and speak out their opinions. Proceeding further, how would you feel if you were forced to wear an iron cage just because you talk in a scold-like manner? Well, number one on the list is Brank. The Brank, commonly referred to as the Scold's Bridle, was a type of corporal punishment mostly used on women in medieval Europe, who were suspected of gossiping, fighting, or otherwise acting in a scold-like manner. In order to silence and degrade women, the gadget forbids them from speaking, eating, or drinking. The alleged woman was used to wearing a mask or an iron cage called a brank over her head. The woman was unable to talk or open her mouth since the mask had a pointy piece of metal or wood sticking out of it. However, it is no longer practiced in modern society, but it shows us the amount of gender inequality women faced in the past. Are you aware of any such severe and brutal punishments that were popular historically? If yes, let us know in the comments section. We'll see you next time.